For Honor. Speaking of single players, we did get to see that single player mode. Yeah, I mean, you were saying that that demo just went on and on. So here's the thing about that game. That's a game that's very, very fun to play, but it can mm -hmm. be kind of hard to watch. Right. Like, it's very, it's very uh, sort of crunchy and uh, heavy, crunchy. but in, like, a great way. Like, it feels like you have heft and everything you're doing has heft and, you know, parrying and counterattacking. And it felt great when I had the controller in my hand at E3 yeah. last year, but it's, it's a little bit hard to sit back and watch and, and sort of get that feel for it. Well, last year we, we saw this game for the first time it sort of gave us echoes of uh, Rise, which was an Xbox One launch title. Um, and it does seem very game, Rise. Yeah, yeah, and that was a game that I think was very fun to watch because it was just really <clears> beautiful. <throat> and the combat, uh, the way it broke down at these sort of one-on-one -on -one scenarios made yeah. it feel almost like Punch-Out-esque, yeah. this big kind of match of these titans. Uh, this is kind of all over the place. And if you're not really yeah. into this theme, um, which I'm hit or miss with. Yeah. Uh, it's it started to lose me a little uh, a little bit through the, well, through this, the demo. Well, this was their single player kind of reveal. I'm yeah. still a bit clueless to actually what's going on. Yeah. I like the cinematic trailer. I thought it was really evocative. Yeah, I agree. But the, there's another entity, Apollo. Apollonia? Yeah. Apollo? yeah. And she's like, is yeah. she resurrecting them time and time again? I don't really she's understand like, what's she's going on. She's making them fight. She's like <laughs> the puppet master making them fight. Yeah. 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 I, I will say, we said in the pre-show, we we're going to get our eyes on single player. I hope it really wowed me. I wouldn't say it really wowed me. I still feel like this is probably like a multiplayer first game, at least for me, uh, in terms of my interest level. Mm -hmm. um, it makes, it, it, it's really, it's mind games. That's what it is. Because the direction that you're attacking, they have to block in. And, and so it's sort of trying to time things just right and play mind games with your opponent. And that really works so much better against another human being than it does sort of against a, a big mass of AIs. Sure. So, well, I hope so we'll they, see. I hope they haven't like tried to put in a single player just because they feel obligated to. Yeah. If yeah. that's if their focus is multiplayer. Well, if they, I mean, what would you, what do you think it would happen if they put it out as just multiplayer again? Everyone would. Comp that's what they do. Oh, they well, that's always a great over, balance, over, right? Yeah. Like either you put in a yeah. single player, no single player, a bad single player, no <laughs> multiplayer. No one's ever really happy. <laughs> yeah. so. well, that's, that's true. Uh, For Honor is out. <coughs> February 14th, Valentine's Day. Oh, yeah, perfect. get ready, baby, <laughs> for, for a <laughs> multiplayer game. Uh